Uh, greetings and welcome back to uh, Midboss, where there has been a bit of a patch, and as such, it seems that we've got some new tutorial uh, pop-ups. Uh, when we're in our inform at the form, any uh, massive form is equipped, you get the benefit of innate abilities from that f uh, form even if they're not selected as active abilities. Uh, okay, we've already seen this one. Also, if we're in inform, our match attributes are multiplied by the best multipliers of all of our equipped master forms. People always say it's best to be ourselves, but in our case, it actually is true. There we, there we go. Hey, boss, I see you smashing a lot of... Oh, my lord. Okay, a lot of bookshelves. Now, I love to take out my aggression on inanimate objects as much as the next limbless demonic spirit. But you should know that the first time you hit a bookshelf, you'll get any loot from it. Just like a chest. You won't get any extra loot from smashing them completely into tiny bits. Although, you might get some satisfaction. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Apparently, our little uh, limbless demonic spirit just wanted to, to tune in there. Right, so... Currently, these are our stats based on the best form that we have equipped. Um, which involves the Warlock, the Minotaur. Yes, I, I've seen the, the comments. It's not a Minotaur, it's a Minotaur. Because there's a Minotaur somewhere else, and the Minotaur is a mini Minotaur, etc, etc. I'm still probably going to call it a Minotaur. Old habits die hard. And we have got the Ghost currently equipped, which honestly, this is one of the best setups that we've seen. I doubt we're going to see a better setup than this for quite some time. Nevertheless, it is in fact time for us to uh, head down to the next level, so uh, let's make our way down. Um, we have totally seen this level, haven't we? Is there any way to move them out? There isn't any way to move. Fine, we're going down. Goodbye. Okay, what are we going to find down here? We're going to find... Whatever you are. Uh, whatever you are has spotted me. Uh, sure. I accept. I'm tempted. I'm certainly tempted. Can I hit you with this? Yes, I can. Pow! Did no damage. It's a hell rat. A hell rat. I approve enormously. Um, uh, let's go for Fireball. This is going to do no damage. It might even heal it, but I want to find out. No, I actually did a lot of damage. Marvelous. Right, I want to uh, absorb you. This is going to hurt, no doubt. Right, Grave Lording. You missed. I did not. Uh, you did miss a second time. Ouch. There we go. I win. Ha <laughs> ha. Ooh, Hellrat has some nice bloody stats. Very well, Hellrat. I shall take you. Let's find out what you do. Uh, okay, the Hellrat has pretty... quite a lot of things. Agile, Envenom, Scurry, Charge. It has the uh, Charge ability, um, dealing damage, and moving to a free tile next to them. This attack, blah, blah, blah. Inferno. 20% uh, chance to deal 4 plus force uh, fire damage as point blank area of effect with a range of 2 when you take damage. Has a 50% chance to inflict burn. Burn inflicts 2% of target's maximum health per stack. Oh, okay. And next ability is explosion. You explode and die. Dealing physical damage equal to your health to the target. <laughs> so rather drastic response, honestly. I'm not sure I completely agree with it, but uh, okay. <laughs> I mean, I guess if that wasn't your imp form, then it would it would be fine. Ooh, evasion resistance. Uh, I mean, that's actually quite a nice one. Let's uh, go ahead and holy water there. That's, those are pretty nice robes. Very, very nice robes. I'm still wearing robes, by the way. Though in my imp form, uh, this hell rat form, I'm not sure if this is the best thing. Um, either way, I think we're going to go to this. There we go. Uh, we've now got guts and reanimation, etc, etc. So let's have a look. Agility plus one, volatile, fire damage, blah, blah, blah imposter, and reanimate. Uh, I have no idea what guts does. Either way, we need a new form to join us. Now, is this more of a... It seems to be much more of a physical form. Very well. Then I am going to go for the ghost. Let's grab the ghost for this. So that we've got the benefit to our equipment. Now, what we don't have the benefit from is our um, magic regeneration, which is a bit of a shame, but oh well. Hello. Let's keep going. We've got a massive room full of treasure. I approve of it all. I'll grab all of these things. There we are. 
Wow, okay, double attack. Despite the fact that I was just told that, that smashing these things is not going to help me, I'm doing it anyway. Because I want to. I'm going to grab you. Right. Um, and Venom, Scary. I mean, it says I've got... Oh, wait, I haven't equipped charge. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Well, I don't need to have that one equipped. Let's switch that one to... Um, you know what? Let's switch that one to Inferno instead. Hello. I would like, I would like to apply... No? Okay. Fair enough. I guess that wasn't really an attack, so it doesn't count. Hello, other rat. I feel kind of bad. Only... No, really, I suppose. Uh, right, let's get through all of this. We want all of the glorious balls of yarn and other sundries that might be hidden amongst us. I love that amongst all of these treasure piles, there are actually piles of balls of yarn. Um, that is that is quite quite uh, pleasing to me. Uh, stealthy light boots. No, none of these particularly good. Uh, I will drop the staff though, and this, and I do need to rearrange my equipment so I don't lose things I want to keep. Uh, of these two, which is the best? Mana Guard. Both of them have got Mana Guard. This one has Accuracy, Stealth, Spirit, and Resistance. This one's got Resistance, Spirit, and Evasion all higher. So I'd be losing Stealth and Accuracy in exchange for Evasion. I honestly don't know which is the best there. I might need a little bit more time to decide. Um, I prefer... The Evasive Master Leather Armor of Reanimation. So this one's a goner. Uh, self potion don't really need. Uh, I would like to keep this down there, out of out of uh, sight, where I'm not going to lose it. Now, the Spiked Shield is glorious, and it is better than this one. Come of Life Leech, oh my lord. The problem with me is I've got so many potions and tomes, and I'm not using any of them. I really should start to use my tomes up. Just to get them out of my inventory. Uh, hello. I would like to use tomes. So, tome of fear? No, I can't reach you with it. Fine, I'll get a little bit closer. Ah! Well, there. That's what you get, you scallywag. Right, tome of fear. I didn't work. Well, that's a bit of a shame. Can I envenom you? I can. That's quite nice. There we are. Ouch. And a Ouch, you are actually starting to hurt me a bit. Um, okay, well, since you're the same thing, I'll just try and capture you. I'm going to be poisoned because I poisoned myself. How many turns? Four turns. Uh, that's fine. I'll still be higher. <laughs> I'm proking my, uh, my explosive frustration. Uh, Tome of Heart Strike. I really do need to find something to sell most of these. Now, hopefully, we will, in fact, find ourselves a merchant somewhere around here. Uh, I'm going to try and take you as well, because I just feel like being completely lazy and taking your health rather than trying to heal. There we go. Yoink. Perfect. Right, what else we got around here? Lots of little bits and bobs. So many crates. Apparently the fish in the crates has been uh, debuffed a little bit. It was a little bit too easy to get ridiculous amounts of crate fish, as we've already been seeing in this playthrough. I do agree with that. Um, it, was, it was almost like, yeah, just every time you see it, you're just going to receive lots of lots of cool stuff. It, 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 there's no no trick to it, no, no difficulty. You'll just receive lots of good things. Uh, yeah, that can go as soon as I find a merchant. Wow, there's a lot of you guys. Uh, Alright then. Well, I'm definitely going to lose a little bit of health here. Like that. Uh, total of infection, total of life loot, sure. Try and draw out your life. Nah, it's not really worth our time. Uh, let's just beat you up enough. And I go again. Yes, I can. And a double strike. Perfect. That double strike is amazing. There we are. I sound so happy when when I claim someone. In a, in a kind of cheeky kind of way. Will you please stop just raging on everything? My lord. Uh, I have got a health potion. Uh, I've got a stealth potion too. 
I'm just going to drop that one, and we're going to pick this up. Okay, onwards in search of a merchant. Ha 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 ha! We found it straight away this time. Marvelous! I am very very pleased. Very pleased. Hello, merchant. Now then, let's have a chat. You and I. Uh, I, no, I want to talk to the merchant. Hwa. I thought I'd blocked myself from talking to the merchant. I was about to be very, very unhappy. Uh, right, okay, this one's going, we know. The Wand of Endurance, yeah, that one's going to Tome of Acid Puddle. Don't, don't really need it. Uh, see, I want to keep this, but our current shield is just better. So, goodbye. You're, you were a great, great uh, shield for a time, but no longer. Tome of Fear, Tome of Rust, Tome of Fear. The Axe of the Resistance. I would say is not as good as my uh, Gravelord's Accurate Master Sword of Focus. So, yeah, that one's off. Tome of Life, Loose Control, Infection, Rust, uh, Blighted, A Light of Boots, Tome of Heart Strike, Robes of the Spirit, Blinding Potion. Now, these, I haven't decided whether I want to get rid of it or not. I mean, I guess the, the knife isn't actually that good. Um... But the double st no, I don't think the knife is that good. We're going to be getting rid of you. Now, as for you guys, the accuracy is really nice there. The stealth is good, but the, the things that I would want a robe for, this one has in in abundance. So yeah, we're going to be getting rid of you as well. Uh, there we are, I think. Let's have a quick look. Yeah, I've just got the gore boots, which I'm pretty happy with. Uh, okay, let's uh, reorganize things a little bit. There we go. Uh, well, actually, you know what? I don't even need that, because realistically speaking, that is not as good as my current I, uh, shield. So let's get rid of that as well. So goodbye, 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 goodbye. There we are. I don't need a accuracy potion specifically. OK, so two more exploring. Uh, I'm not going to pick all these up. I'll pick them up later and uh, swing back past the uh, merchant and make some money. Uh, however, I will get the speed potion. That one I actually do kind of like. What I'll probably do is I'll save all of the uh, looting until it. My goodness, there's so many of these things here. And I still haven't healed. Uh, restored my mana. Ah, uh, I'm just just full of failure. Full of failure. This is going to hurt a little bit. Thankfully, I should be able to take you out fairly quickly. You, you managed to poison me. You, why are you so good at this? Oh, that really hurts. That hurts so much. I'm going to have to use a health potion just to survive that. And that's only going to protect me for a little tiny bit. Uh, I'm actually going to die to that. Okay, well, fine. Out we go. Uh, I should have just not used the health potion. And that was all because I didn't rest. Because I'm an idiot. Okay, well, on the plus side... If this level is sort of anything, those hell rats are in abundance, so we don't really need to worry about it too much. But what I do need to do is equip my uh, uh, blood axe for now, just so that I can start absorbing health from things I attack. Okay, and we'll open you up as well. Damage potion, don't really care for it. Heavy boots, Ooh, I mean, it's very unlikely, but we'll have a look. Very unlikely indeed. Yep, yep, they're not as good. Fair enough. There we are. Onwards to hopefully victory. Hello. I want to kill you. Ah, oh, leave me alone. Man. All right, well, first and foremost, let's go for this. There we go. Ten health, and then wallop you as well. There, oh, I didn't actually get much from that. Can I start drawing your life out? Uh, did very little, actually. Remarkably little. Um... I'm going to try and set you on fire while I've got the opportunity to. I'm going to try to not set me on fire. I did. Fantastic. Uh, very little health coming out of you right now. Okay. Well, I'm regenerating as it is. Oh, that was a good hit. Um, sure, let's go for another life leech. There we are. Wow. Life leech does a lot of damage. I'm not gaining much health from life leech. But I'm doing a heck of a lot of damage with it. Which I suppose is okay. Hello. Uh, axe of Strength. Yeah, don't need it really. Uncommon main hand weapon. Uh, he hello. I really don't want you doing anything crazy straight away. So I'm just going to jump in there before you get the chance to do too much. 
And we're going to try to stab you again. Ouch, 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 ouch. It hurts. It really does hurt. There we go. You are now dead. Hooray! Mana potion for me. Let's go up here and regenerate a little bit. Um, at this point, we don't strictly need the blood axe, so let's swap back to this. Get the mana potion down there. As I would very much like to be able to grave lord. Uh, can I reach you? Not quite. I can probably reach you with this, though. Not going to do much damage with it, but you know. Grave loading. Give him a charge up. Hello. And then I'm just going to wallop you a couple of times. A couple more times. Uh, I could just take your form, but honestly, I don't need it. I don't even think your form is better than the form I've got right now. It has come to that point. Uh, sure, we'll check out a, a regular shield. I mean, <laughs> uncommon now seems regular to me. Hello! That was silly. You shouldn't have attacked me. You've only made me angry. There we go. Uh, what else are we going to find in here? Another Minotaur, more than likely. Let's continue wandering around. I could heal up. I'm honestly looking for a hell rat right now. I'm going to be so gutted if we we met all the hell rats already. And we just met them all in one go. And now that's it. No more hell rats for us. We are being denied hell rats. Uh, okay, grave loading. And, oh, you still one away. Okay, I'll just smash this. Now you're close enough. Very nice. Finish you off if we can. Oh, that is so powerful. <laughs> so ridiculously powerful. Uh, thank you. I think that was a hell... It is a hell rat! Fantastic! Yes, come over here! Right, okay, so... Uh, not quite close enough yet. We'll hit you with some magic missile, you know, just to... Get this party started. And... There we are. And the counter-attacks were incredible. Yes, please! Oh, my lord. There we go. Hello! Uh, I actually kind of feel a little bit bad. Just sat there, being a vampire bat, doing what vampire bats do. Not bothering anyone. Then some possessed hell rat comes up and just wallops you across the noggin. Doesn't even say sorry afterwards. Just kind of wanders off. Uh, right. Hmm. I'm gonna need you to get a little bit closer. Hello. There we go. I'm probably gonna lose Gravelord in the next turn. Yes. Fatigue potion. Don't like the sounds of that. Uh, right. Uh, explosion. You explode and die. I, I mean, there's no, <laughs> no point in that one. Volatile. Innate passive. Fire. Damage reduced by 50%. That's actually pretty nice. That is actually pretty nice. And that, that actually um, surprises me, given that the Hellrat I used Fireball on right at the beginning, when we entered the level, took 20 damage. Is my Fireball that powerful? I can't imagine that it is. My lord. Oh, my lord. Hello, then. Come on. Come on down here. There we go. Thank you. That's so powerful. I do need to rest, though. See, see, I noticed. Shush. I almost didn't, but I did in the end. Wow. Tome of Fester? Attack which has a 35% chance to disease your foe for 10 turns. Disease reduces stamina regeneration by 50%. Okay, well, that's a new spell, certainly. Uh, what are we going to find over here? Other than just a broken bookcase. Tome of Vomit. Eh, not, not a big fan. Hello, everyone. Uh, right. Well, I don't have any nice AoE abilities. Accuracy potion. That's not a terrible one. You know what? If the monsters are happy to let, let me... Uh, they're not anymore. I was going to say, if they're just happy to let me smash these crates, then I'm in no... Great hurry to destroy them utterly. I'm gonna leave that zombie there though. Because once I've uh, mastered the hell rat form, I'm actually going to try and take the zombie. And you know what? I've realized this whole time I've been using my mouse to move around. And that was silly because I'm significantly faster at controlling this game. As with most roguelikes. Ah, oh, you've noticed me. That's a bit of a shame. Uh, as with most roguelikes, I'm just a lot faster at uh, controlling it with the keyboard. Okay. Not a lot. Okay, moving on. Hello, skeleton. 
Um, I'll come back to this room later. Oh, okay, perhaps not. And then you coming over? Thank you. Oh, what have we got there? We have got a dome of scurry. Not particularly useful, but we'll take it for now. Uh, okay, well, I'm gonna go up and check the top left because I haven't fully explored that area. And yet I feel that I fully explored this area. Yeah, there's that one room there that I have not fully um, exposed yet. And since I'm going back up past the uh, merchant, I may as well grab these things on the way. Just because I'm heading there. Grab you. There we go. And here we are. Okay. Now then, we'll hopefully get a reasonable amount from this. I should really check what the merchant has to offer, actually. Hello. I would like to sell many, many things. Pretty much everything that is at the top of the list list. Uh, yeah, probably the accuracy potion as well. It just really doesn't do much for me. Plunge potion, the blinded potion, the accuracy potion. Yeah, they, those all need to go. But, 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 but. What have you got to sell? The Infernal Master Shield of Power. Okay. Gains Inferno. Um, we'd have double Master Guard. Significantly more constitution and toughness. Uh, we'd lose the critical, we'd lose endurance and focus, and the damage bonus, but we'd gain an ability. That's actually quite tempting. I've got to be honest there. The four pull amulet of strength. It's quite a nice one. It's actually just better than my Vorpal Earring of Strength. The Vorpal Ring of Focus. Ring of Endurance. I'm another force. Relentless, evasive, ma uh, master plate of constitution. Okay, has thorns. Has a lot of invasion. A lot of constitution, a lot of toughness. Uh, this one is getting my vote right now. Maybe. Uh, simply because... The rising stats that I would like armor to rise. Cold Iron Cleaver. Critical 22. Cold Iron Cleaver deals 50% more damage to magical creatures. Uh, that's pretty cool. But it's nowhere near as good as the Grave Lord's accurate Master Sword of Focus. Not for my current build. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm going to grab that and I'm going to grab you. There we go. Also, I'm going to grab you. There we are. Uh, have you got any awesome things that I'd like to buy from you? I don't think you do. Uh, magic missile, bone, bone spear. Throw a bone spear at your enemies, dealing piercing damage and pulling the target towards you. Come here! Uh, no. We are going to equip these. That is going to go in there. Perfect. So much better. This, honestly, will lose reanimation. Don't care too much about that. And this is going to... We are going to end up with quite a lot of health as a result of these. Because of the constitution. Yeah, actually, I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, this has also increased our power a fair bit. Let's have a look at this right now. Focus is fairly low. Um, overall, oh, I'm a size small as well, which is actually quite nice. So we're actually very, very fast right now because of that. Okay, that was that was a good good uh, purchase, in my opinion. Let's get rid of these. Get them out of my inventory. They're just call, taking up room that I don't want taken up. That is a lot of health. 171 health. Fantasticus. Right, okay, let's go and see what we can see. Other than a load of stuff that I could take to the merchant in time. Uh, hello, Minotaur. Uh, I'm at full mana right now. Yes, yes, it is I. Explodey rat. Uh, grave loading. Do a massive chunk of damage, super fast. Ah, I don't like being afraid. Uh, don't even need Grave Lord for you, Scalabag. Okay, let's rest up as well. There really isn't a reason ever to not rest. Are you running away? Uh, I thought I thought I'd, I'd I'd crossed that threshold and like I'm now powerful enough that the creatures of the same make fear me. No, don't kill him completely. Oh. <laughs> there you go. I passively killed you. Uh, right, there we are. Have we? Oh, we've mastered you. Okay. So you've got Agile, Volatile, and Inferno are your passives. And with Scurry, you can get... Uh, applies haste buff to yourself. For this turn, you can move one additional space. Use equip one additional item or change one additional equip ability. I mean, it's a nice ability and all that, but... Um, 
I just don't think we really want you as our form. It's, it's, it's tempting for the Agile, Volatile, and Inferno, because those are really nice abilities, but... Um, Fireball, Life Leech, yeah. Staff Mastery, Accessory Mastery, and Arcane. Because Accessory Mastery we're just gaining right now. All Rings roll again for Weapon Procs. All Amulets roll again for Armor Procs. It's really potent. It's a really potent combination. Uh, the Minotaur, we've got Bloodlust, Tough, and Gore currently. Is, uh, is there anything else I could have? I think all of these, uh, yeah, they're all passives. It's got a lot of passives. So I'm only really gaining the benefit from two actives there, because I gain all of the passives anyway. Got Sword Play, Armor Massa, Weapon Massa. Got Ethereal, uh, so I, I should just equip that, really. Uh, and Heart Strike. So Ethereal allows me 50% of physical damage taken is converted to mana loss for eight turns. There we go. Got a couple of extra abilities there. And you are down. Very well. Now I don't have to worry about walking all the way back up here to uh, investigate this part of the dungeon once we've finished exploring it all. Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah, uh, oh, okay. You, you can make me afraid, I suppose. I will allow it for this one turn only. Uh, I'm going to try and life leech you guys into oblivion. There we go. That, that worked. Oh, I'm at full health. Never mind. I I mistook the uh, fear for having done some amount of damage to me, but no. Hello. I don't even need to use Gravelord on you. I'm that powerful at the moment. At least compared to you, I am. Oh, I just realized. I realized the room. Oh, never mind. We've got a zombie over here. Fantastic. I'd really like to claim that zombie first. Hello. Would you, would you join my army? Uh, I'm taking a little bit of damage, but it's nothing I'm too worried about. There we go. Yes. I will become a zombie. Now, let's have a quick look at this form. Uh, zombie. We're currently learning Shambler. We've currently got Body Slam. Our focus is on strength. So, let's go for... I want to say Ghost, I think, is one of the better ones to have right now. So we'll go with Ghost, and we're just going to uh, slay you. Now, I'm a little bit concerned about this form because we are reasonably weak compared to our other forms in this ship. And let's go back to uh, using the keyboard so I'm not uh, moving around like a derp. There we are. Uh, we'll just take you down. Super easy to do. Uh, what tome be that? This be a tome of vomit. Sure. I'll vomit on things, it's fine. Uh, right. Now you maybe... Oh, I'll try it. I've got both of you at the same time. Okay. Grave Lording, because I suspect... Oh, you didn't charge me. Very well. Uh, I'm a little bit surprised by that, but sure. Not a huge amount of damage. Oh, wow. Wow. How... What? How have I got that ability? Why am I... Oh, it's because of my... That's right, my armor now has Inferno. Never mind, then. I was a little bit confused. There we go. One down, ability learned. Fantastic. And let's take you out as well. Perfect. Right, it took very little damage there, but we learned a new ability. We learned Shambler. Minus one speed, strength increased by 20, constitution increased by 20%. Okay, that's not terrible. Infection. And all physical attacks which will raise the enemy as a zombie if they are killed by it. Oh, that is so good. Honestly, this would be a reason for me to accept zombie in my uh, normal form lineup. Even though it's not strictly speaking a great form compared to the other forms that I've got. But wow, the ability to raise minions... Uh, that's pretty good in my book. I, I, I would have to say, pretty excited. Pretty excited for that. Uh, though it does depend on how powerful the minions are, I guess. The minions might be utterly rubbish. In which case, I'll be a little bit sad. Because I've been looking forward to uh, having minions for a long time. Uh, hello. Uh, sure, we, we can do this, I suppose. I really should have uh, gotten some more mana. But, oh well. As ever. I, I forget to regenerate mana. There we go. And ability learned. Wow, that fast. Okay. 
Uh, Biohazard is the next one, which is a passive. 10% chance of poison for three turns when physically damaged. Okay. Uh, uh, the zombie is actually starting to uh, warm on me. I'll be honest. Uh, can we go for an infection attack? Almost. No, not a counter. Ah, oh, yes. Uh, we were totally 100% going to get a zombie minion there, and you ruined it with your counter attack. Stupid zombie. Oh, well. Uh, we should be moving a little bit slower than normal right now. In fact, I'm going to check that in a second. Uh, grab that as well. Hello. Ow. Ow. Super ow. Can I get this? I mean, you're not really doing much damage to me. I'm more worried that... Oh, ha, 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 ha. More worried that I'll kill you with a counterattack. I have a zombie minion. Fantastic. Right, what we got now? Biohazard has been learned as passive. 10% chance to poison. Next ability is Rot. Innate passive. Poison damage reduced by 50%. Okay. I mean, that makes a, a bit of sense. Actually, considering how dangerous poison damage is... Yeah, okay. Okay, you have my attention. Ah, uh, no. You have my attention also, but it's in a way I don't want. Right, my, my zombie is killing things for me. Well done, zombie. I'm going to come down and I'm going to help. Uh, or I was going to. Will you please stop shooting me with your magic missiles, you scoundrel? Okay, that, no, no, bad, naughty, naughty, long range rat, ah, sky rats, no, dislike. Will you please join my team? Thank you. Okay, uh, let's rest up a little bit. All right, you go. Ah, oh, what have I done? <laughs> I'm not a very good zombie master, I, I will confess. I'm a bad, bad zombie master. Um, I really need to get over there though, you see. So this is going to be a pain because you know what I'm up to. Oh my lord, you're about to kill me. This is not not good. No, 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 no. I've, I haven't got anything. <gasps> no, <laughs> stupid zombie. Um, if I change form, I'll get a bit of health. Let's do. Let's try to leave. Okay, yeah, I, I know when I'm beat. I'm sorry, zombie, but you're going to have to wait for me to master you. Because that was dangerous. <sighs> I've got some gear, which gives me high resistance. We'll see. We'll see. I might need to go in there. Oh, no, not again. Not, not again. Uh, I super duper need to charge you. You need to be dead. Immediately. Ah, oh, no bad times. Oh, he angered the Minotaur. I approve. I will drink your blood. Uh, I probably angered the Minotaur now as well. Oh, I love the fact that they can they can all you know hate on each other. That's that's brilliant. I'm just gonna keep drinking your blood. Ah, no, no, I'm your friend, friend of my enemy and all that. Uh, sorry, the enemy of my enemy. No, no, bad, bad, naughty Minotaur. I'm just going to keep drinking your blood. I'm not getting much from it, but I'm going to keep doing it anyway. No, nope. all of your blood. Need it all. For reasons. For reasons. Keep giving me your blood. As long as you keep missing your hits, then this is a net game for me. Even though it took me a long time to do. Ah, uh, Well, you know. I suppose. What I would love is if I could finish learning the zombie... Then take out the Yeah, you know what? Let's let's go back and find that bloody zombie. Then I'm gonna go and slay that magic bat in my imp form, which I feel is significantly more capable. Okay, now we're at the merchant. A to sell stuff. B because it's close to the, the zombie, but C because it has the tome of bone spear. Now, if I can't weather the destructive force of that that bat magic then at least I can try and pull it to me so there's less distance before I, ha I can start actually doing damage to it. That is my plan. It might not be a good plan, I don't know yet. Um, either way, let's uh, take you out, please. And kapow! There we go. You shall now be mine. Yoink! Oh, that's just mean. Why, why you gotta be so mean? Move here. No, no, don't make me counter-attack you. Oh. 
No! No, no, no counterattacking. There we go. Fantastic. Now you also. Fantastic. I've got many, many minions. Uh, I need to have many, many more though before we get down there. Um, now, what I what would be good is we had like some uh, innate of yeah, you take fifty percent less magic damage. That would be nice. I would totally be on board with that. That one minion, uh, one battle rather. Okay, let's make our way down here. Uh, are you coming with me? Oh, they don't follow me. Useless minions. Oh, I should just go up there and murderize you for the e EXP. I hope you get EXP. That would be ridiculously cheaty though. I will confess. Yeah, that, that's annoying. Stop, stop. No bad. Bad, naughty. Huh. You know what? I'm moving slowly right now, but let's see how this works. No, no, it only has one charge. Ah, dread. Okay. Let's try and get closer. Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. Please stop. Please stop, it hurts. I would like to kill you. Ow, 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 ow. See, I'm tempted to just absorb you right now. <laughs> just so I get my health back. However, let's try this instead. Oh, it's going to take me a while. But since you're in close proximity, you don't seem to be doing any of your magic missiles. No, don't cause me to counterattack you. There we go. Ability learned. Hooray. Have we mastered? Oh, thank goodness we have mastered. Right, so sh um, biohazard, shambler. I see the shambler is the really nasty one and rot, but with body slam and infection. Uh, see, I really don't know if I want this form. Either way, let's uh, revert back. Let's have, a, let's have a quick gander. If I get rid of the, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> the Minotaur, I lose my regen. I also lose my tough and my gore. Gore doesn't matter to me. Lose body slam and I lose charge. See, charge is nice because I can close distance with things. Um, where's my zombie friend over here? Rock Shambler and Biohazard. See, I'm not particularly certain that I those would be good, and the only thing would be infection, really. And as we've seen, infection isn't actually that good. It's not like a, a true a, a true um, pet class. Because the pets don't follow you around, which is kind of the whole point of having pets. Man. Let's, uh, let's grab up some of these things. Uh, we are going to go to that, that bat last, I think. Hello. I need to get past. Sorry, but no. There we are. Let's grab a little bit of everything. Silly zombie pets. I guess if they were intelligent, it would be way too too powerful because you can make them so easily. Uh, hello. Ah, oh, you're gonna be a scallywag, aren't you? Okay, well let's close this distance as fast as I can. It's one down and two down, almost. Uh, sure, let's uh, go for a heart strike. There we are. Perfect. Now I am interested in finding out what that bat is, though. I guess, given that, I really should go over to it and try and capture it now. Rather than wasting my time over here. The problem is, it is through a couple of rooms that I'm going to have to take together. So I'll bring you back in a moment. Okay, we are there, ready for the death bat. So, in preparation for the death bat, let's put on these robes. There we go. Should be somewhat more protected from its crazy, crazy abilities. Where are you, death bat? Death bat? Uh, oh, we're not there yet. No, I lied. I lied. I made it up. We're not actually there yet. We are there now. Here we are. All right, death bat. There are oh, death bat. Notice me immediately. Still bloody hurts. Um, can I reach anything? I cannot. I need to get a little bit closer before I try. No, stop having so many attacks. Uh, right, it dealt no damage, but I can use charge to get all the way over here. If I can use this without having to use bone spear, I'd be happy. Because Bone Spear is something which uh, I can't... Oh, so I've only got one charge on. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, in this current situation that I find myself in, we're going to be Grave Lording. 
It's done a chunk of damage. I would like to try and possess you if I can. Heart strike. Okay. Uh, dive attack there. Okay. Um, it has actually removed my... Stamina is all gone. Oh no, that was, that was silly. I, I hurt myself more than I hurt it. I hurt myself a lot more than I hurt it. <laughs> oh no! That was silly. Uh, okay, Bone Spear. I can't even reach for Bone Spear. We might be about to die. And worse still, to a massive self derp. Um, can I get you now? Almost, but not yet. No, no, not stealing my lives. I want to reserve that for Heart Strike. I am going to use Bone Spear here. Come here. Oh, we got a free attack as well. And Heart Strike. No, it's got Ethereal. Oh, that is massive pain. Ouch. No, it finished me off. And largely, I imagine, because I flamed myself. Oh, man. So frustrating. That bat, though. Ah, the ether bat is healed for 10 points. Well, we tried. I have no idea how much health it has. So it could be that we would have lost that fight anyway. But, uh, yeah, I, I feel that... Uh, that fireball certainly didn't help our chances. Not even slightly. Okay, Count of Acula survived for uh, 15,301 turns, loved to be a minotaur, strolling through the dungeon, grave-lording hapless fools. Shame they couldn't beat the Etherbat in a magic duel. Yes. Pretty much. <laughs> Pretty much. Let's have a look. We've got Platinum, Closed Beta. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm going to make it a Platinum card. <laughs> there we go. And uh, save. I had some nice things on me there. Some very nice things. But that is going to be the end of this episode. Sorry that we went down in such a derpy way. But uh, no, the Etherbat was quite a challenge. We had no real way of uh, dealing with it quickly because of the Ether. It was just, yeah, it's fine. I, I am just going to throw all the spells at you all the time. Then I'm going to blink away just because, you know, I, I just feel like it. Again, I'm clinging to the hope that that Etherbat had a lot of health. And that there was no chance that I've gone through it with the, the extra 20 health and plus the fire damage health that I was losing as well. But oh my lord. There are so many places that I could have done better. If I hadn't have used my health potion against the flame rat early on, I would have still had it for that encounter. Though, honestly, I probably would have used it on the on the zombie, but oh well. That is it for me, though. I do hope you've enjoyed mid-boss and will be joining me again should I play it again. Do let me know down in the comments if you want to see more of it in the future. But for now, that's going to be it from me. So thank you very much for joining me. I do hope you enjoyed death and all, and I'll see you next time. But until then, take care, everyone.